Don't start the next game. Lizard Man also bodying at him, by the way. Got him in the corner, almost got stunned, sitting on a perfect, got a little bit of chip, got the stun. Takes the game. All right. Lizard took the game over Adam. You want to update the score? What are we at? 0 1 right now? All right. So Street Fighter is still, still giving me the please wait, but Stream is, is back up to full blast. All right. Cool. Cool. So wait, so you're back in the lobby now and you click to spectate? Uh, no, I just have the, uh, the please wait spinner right now in Street Fighter, unfortunately. All right, well, they did go ahead and start the next game. Right, so they're playing out game two. Uh, I guess I'll get play-by-play. -play. Stuff is happening, guys. All right, Lizard, Lizard already got Adam in the corner. V reversal's out. Nicely done, nicely done. Good timing. Ooh, crush counter chop. Oh, this is not confirmed. Unfortunate. Lizard is at half health, though. Nonetheless, Adam, a little bit sitting about two-thirds. But now, nice V trigger confirm. Gets a combo, half health on each player, but you're in the corner. Text the throw. Nicely done, Adam. Uh, Mash's jab. Oh, always a classic. I see too much V-trigger, too, from, from Mr. Lizardman. Adam actually delays the wake-up and goes right over. Lizardman not ready for that. All right, both people on just a pixel of life are close enough to it, but Lizardman takes it. Basic footsies. This is terrible. I hate play-by-play -play commentary. Yeah, I'm definitely going to be having uh, words with my ISP for that drop. You can sue for a uh, loss of making money. I, I don't know the word for that. Even though you know you're not making any money from this. Shh, don't tell oh my that. god, Lizard Man just threw Adam's V reversal. What a beast. Honestly, just a bad time to V reversal by Adam. Like wasn't even like like a hard read on it or anything. But uh Adam finally lands that one combo we were talking about him dropping. And again, Lizard Man just gets a hit because he used a V trigger immediately. People haven't noticed yet. Already up game two. Took game two, 2-0. Two -oh. Remember, Lizardman is on the winner's side, right? Adam needs to take three games just to reset. I don't know if they got the message now to not start, not start the next game. And so we can make sure it's on stream. You might need to restart Street Fighter, honestly. Reason. Mm-hmm. If you're just still in that place, wait. Yeah, I think I, I'm going to have to do that. Oh, it, wait, no, it looks like signs of life. Okay, they did uh, They did pull out. So I guess they heard. All right, yeah, I think, I think what had happened is it got stuck trying to get back into spectating. So now that, uh, okay. now that they've popped out, I'm good to go again. All right, nice. Nice to hear. So we'll who get took back the on last track one here? for you guys then in the chat. That are was one, Lizard Man one, again. One? Oh, no, 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 Lizard Man took it. So 2-0. We're gonna have to reverse right, it shows course that here. one one because of uh, how it works with clicking to return to lobby. Just whoever clicked to return to lobby says they lost the game, even if they didn't. Let's do this. Really interesting how that works. More, please wait. So yeah, Lizardman already sitting on a match point. You know, he's he's had a strong showing so far, taking both games. But uh, Adam has certainly taken rounds, and most most games have been very close. Lizardman definitely setting the pace, though. Looks like we're going to be seeing Forgotten Waterfall here, the original Street Fighter V stage. I actually love this stage; it's really pretty. 
really uh, interesting design, and obviously, you know, the, the, the tie-ins well. to the lore are nice, Don't too. This is all where, uh, where Ryu hangs out totally mm -hmm. with all the he, New Zealand yeah, animals. He puts his he puts his feet in that crisscross position, and he's like, "Animals around me." Yes. It's because Ryu's a Disney princess. No, you didn't know. He's a yeah, sure. He's a Disney princess. Wow, Lizard Man getting so body, he's already gotten stunned, V trigger, and dead. He actually shook out of that stun, but wasn't able to get the block up in time. Yeah, that's uh, something that's funny that happens sometimes, because, you know, you, you shake out, but then... Right, like, you're still clicking buttons to shake out. And moving the stick. <sighs> but I think he just barely actually didn't shake out fast enough. It's possible, Either yeah. way, he got hit. And he died. Definitely got hit, definitely died. There we go, we got a V-reversal on deck. Yeah, we've got been seeing that from Adam a lot, trying to get the pressure. There's the stun again. Oh, and yeah, and he drops the base. Days. Didn't need the full jumping combo. Chop was more than Durian enough. Wins. Adam going ahead and putting a point on the scoreboard for the Urian players out there. Yeah, Reethan's DC killing all momentum of Lizard Man. It's all my fault. Yep. We just want to make it more interesting for you guys. See, we gave Adam time to think. Now he knows what's up. How he needs to be playing. Uh, he's on the Forgotten Waterfall. Got the Waterfall to his back, right? Lizard Man, he's on the other side. Adam. Adam's in the meditation room. Waterfall. Got some Kakapos underneath the Waterfall there. Alright, but Lizard Man getting the Crush Counter with barely any damage. Holy shit. That... I gotta imagine Rashid can do more after that. Maybe that's just like hard to hit confirm the more. But like, that, that was no damage. That was so disappointing for a crush count. <laughs> yeah, that, Adam, keep dropping that. Keep dropping that. I wonder if it's a lot harder to do uh, online, because you don't know how long to charge a fireball, or can you even change it? Charge a fireball at different timings, or is it just the one-hit and two-hit version? I'm, I'm not 100% sure. It might even just be like a height or spacing dependent thing as well. Uh, maybe, yeah. Only certain hits of the anti-air will launch them into fireball. Alright, but anyway, still Lizard Man, every time he clicks that V trigger button, he just, he just. just uses it. Just uses it. You know? It's not something you can do. There's definitely like counterplay to that. Alright, here we go. There we go. That time was clean. Got the crush counter punished right there. Read the, the, read the DP reversal and went ahead and Ooh, put that it back in the corner. Oh, There's the stun. That Takes time. Gets that additional meter. Already on full CA anyway. But, uh, just a good hat. Alright. This is, uh, this is match point for Lizard Man. If he wins this round, he takes the tournament. Yeah, but, uh, Adam got full CA. That's true. Got that, got that butter. Just saying. M more base to be dropped. We got pressure. I was in busting out the V reversal a few times, so against that Rashid pressure, but uh, not here. Shows him to poke out instead and doing so pretty successfully. Oh, right, here it go. is. Dubstep Urian. And just one one clean good hit away. Got V-Trigger and V-Reversal if he chooses. You know we're going to be seeing a V-Trigger from Rashid. Never mind the X spinner instead. Yeah, X whatever that's called, I mean. Tornado? No. Oh, ah, Ooh, oh. tried to go for the overhead in the, was in the Aegis Reflection. Used that as defense. Good time to go for it, but Lizard did manage to block it. Ah, uh, yeah. Oh, and Yurian right. just steps back and says, uh, how about this mirror, right bro? Not right there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we just saw a fireball, knee-jerk reaction to, to jump into it, but... Got something waiting for you. Round one. Fight. All right. So this uh this game, whoever takes this one, we're either gonna have a end of the tournament or a bracket reset. Yep. Two to two. 
first set grand finals. Adam still looking for his first place win. Don't give him no second place curse. Yeah, we've seen really great uh, EXDPs from Lizardman. Just, just using it enough. To be fair, he doesn't always have the meter for it because, as he's been busting out all his, all his pressure, in addition to staying on the offensive so much. That is true as well, and I mean the offense is really where you want to be with Rashid. Definitely, definitely. That's where he shines. Those have been really good throw attacks from Adam. Uh, this man's gone for that a couple times, right? But the cross up throw in the corner, cross up empty jump throw. And Adam's tech them, I think, every time. Close to it. Great awareness on that. Oof. But that time it gets baited. There's a good crush counter combo. That's what we like to see. Unfortunately, just, just whiffing Urian in a... Rushy taking advantage. There we go. A little bit earlier, you saw that though, uh... Right, being a bit too V trigger happy, and Yurian, Mr. Adam at least, noticing, pokes him in the startup. Okay, he take this right here. No, drops it a little bit. Oh, oh that, but finishes it up. Go. Still have the second reflector. All you need. All you need. You only need one. You get two for some reason, but you only need one. So now Adam's got Liz in the corner. Throw loops. Delayed text actually throws him off enough. There we go. V trigger two again. So three in. And there we go. Keeping the pressure off. Right. Unfortunately, weak punish there. Oh my god, that kills. I didn't even realize he had full CA. And that'll do it. Congratulations to Lizard Man. Well done, That's Adam. That's the day. Going nonetheless. But the second place curse might be a real thing. Don't worry, the nice thing about curses is they always break. Well, the other thing is, the second place curse when it comes to a season like this isn't even that bad of a curse because that still puts Adam number one on the seed list. Yeah, the people that make the most money in tournaments are the people who always get seconds, not the people who occasionally get first. But then sometimes you're Sonic Fox and you always get first. <laughs> it's go time. All right, so only let's sometimes give a, uh... are you Sonic Fox, though. I know me personally, I am only sometimes Sonic Fox. I don't know about you guys in chat. I don't know about you guys in the turn. But I can't always be Sonic Fox. Congrats again to, uh, to Lizardman301, our week four winner. He's going to be uh, able to enjoy the champion's role in Discord until the next tournament. And, uh, of course, all of the bragging rights he can eat. <laughs> and the qualification. And the qualification. And this yeah, all yeah. brought to you by our sponsor, of course, Matcharino, helping us put together a prize pool that we can send to donation to Child's Play Charities. If you check your screen right now, we've got a tiny URL up. We've got... Oh! Oh! Missed the link in chat. Screw it Let's up. see. <laughs> Get it back. Here you go. There you go. Link in chat for Matcharino. You can use the coupon code on screen right now is GD9, and I think that's an L. Uh, if you type that yeah, that's in... That's a real question. It'll make the donation pool go up by one dollar. You don't have to give a dollar. You just have to give the coupon code. The donation pool magically generates a dollar for you when you type that in. If you do want to give a dollar, that's amazing. Give as much as you feel comfortable doing. We also have some nice merch. We've got shirts. We've got Soylent. That helps out uh, New Challenger. Helps out uh, the kids of Child's Play Charity as well. Uh, thanks again to, for everyone who entered. And uh, see you 
two weeks from now for the next tournament. Make sure to tell your friends, get some more people up in here as well. Only halfway through, so you can certainly still qualify. Even at the last tournament, you can always qualify. Because all you also need is top 16, right? You don't, need, you don't need the most points. You might have a bad seed, but you can still get in. As long as you're doing well. Or Almost showing up consistently. Almost forgot. We should also give a shout out here to all of our uh, brothers and sisters at New Challenger community. We've got our Discord. We've also got all the people who put together good content for the channel here. That includes Monday Night Dumpster Fire with Joe Monday. Our very own New Challenger North American Underdog Series. We've also got the EU Underdog Series. We've got the Dragon Ball Fighter Z Z League Series. We've got just uh, the new challenger uh, coaches in the Discord, always here for you. Uh, as well as beginner breakdowns every Friday with uh, KZA and Seth series. Send in your replays and they will tell you all about them. Anyone else you want to put a shout out to, uh, Insight? Uh, shout out to Rethan. Great TO. Got everything covered. Even while commentating. I don't know if you know him. He sucks at Dragon Ball. <laughs> <laughs> I do. I do. It's horrible. <laughs> the worst. Uh, but I haven't given up yet. Hey. I might not be great at fighting games, but I'm great at continuing to play badly at fighting games. Well, as long as you're having fun, right? <laughs> that's, that's one thing that, that Wait, I... Wait, I was supposed up. to be having fun? <laughs> oh well uh, yeah that's one thing I love about fighting games is, uh, you know you can always have fun just playing someone around your level right whether you're a pro or whether you're trash whether you're casual or whether you're competitive like as long as you're playing someone that's at your level you can have fun or you can just go to the local and eat chicken wings that too <laughs> as long as they're fried alright well that's it for us tonight Thanks, everybody, for tuning in. Thanks to everybody who came out to play. Congratulations to Lizardman301. Hope to well see done. you at the well grand done. finals. You are qualified. And of Sign course, on. that still leaves Adam as our number one seed. Yes, it does. Leaderboards will be updated on Discord soon. Good night. Peace.